What's up, you guys? This is Pastor Boris. Um, as you know, our church is doing a series of prayers, and so um, I want you to join me in this prayer for this video. I'm specifically going to pray for Crossman's Church as a whole. So join me as we pray together. God, thank you so much for uh, this day, for life, health, strength, for who you are, who you continue to be in our lives. We thank you, God, for yet another opportunity to have breath, to be able to, 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 to inhale and exhale, to be able to live, breathe, and move, and have our very being in also the ability to walk and have the activities, activities of our limbs as well. We don't take those things for granted. Um, we also thank you, God, for uh, the gift of the church, the bridegroom of Christ, God, the, the ecclesia, the temple, uh, where we gather and worship you, as well as where we gather to uh, hear a word from you as well through your man or woman servant. Um, I pray specifically, God, in this video for Crosswinds Church. God, you've done so many incredible things throughout this ministry um, and its existence. And, um, I'm so thankful. I'm so honored to be able to be a part of this ministry, but not just in a sense of serving on staff, but I'm so glad to be a part of this church as a member because I truly know that you dwell in Crosswinds Church. You dwell within the sanctuary. You, you dwell in the hearts and minds of all the parishioners that are connected to that local assembly. And even more, God, you dwell uh, wherever we are present. Um, when we wear a Crosswinds hat, when we wear a Crosswinds hoodie, God, you, you are with us. And so I pray uh, for Crosswinds leadership. I pray for Pastor Chris. I thank you, God, for the vessel that he is and the vessel that he will continue to be uh, as he holds up the bloodstained banner and as he points people to Christ and also points them to the cross. I pray, God, that you will strengthen him where he's weak and build, build him up where he's torn down. God, prop him up on every leading side. Allow him to know that his health, his health and his strength, it comes from you. And so, God, I pray that every time he looks to the hills, from whence cometh his help, that um, you will be with them. And I pray even the more that you will strengthen them for the days ahead. And I thank you, God, for what he has been, not just across from his church, uh, but to every specific family um, individually throughout the time of Cross from his church being in existence. Uh, God, don't, don't, don't just bless him, but bless his family, bless his incredible wife, bless his children, um, bless his in-laws, bless uh, his family, uh, local and abroad, and um, allow them to continue to just be uh, supporters, not just in word, but also in, also in deed. Um, I also pray, God, for Pastor Scott, um, our incredible worship pastor. God, I pray um, even the more, God, that as you gave uh, psalms and songs to the psalmist uh, of, the old, of, of, of the Old Testament, that you would continue to give him the strength as a musician to lead us uh, into dimensions of worship that we've never, ever seen. I pray, God, even the more that you would equip him, God, to be a, a, a leader, not just in standing on the mic with the stage and uh, 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 telling us what songs to sing and how to sing them. But I pray even the more, God, that you will lead him to be a walking example of you, um, not just in Cross Miss Church, but wherever he is, uh, even if he's doing the local gig in Leland or if he's doing community endeavors as our community pastor as well, um, wherever he is, God, I pray even the more that you allow him to be uh, a representation of you in the ways that he walks, talks, behaves, and lives, God, not just don't just bless him, but bless his family, bless his incredible wife, uh, bless his children, um, bless all those that are connected to him uh, famili familiarly, uh, as well as God, um, his friends. I pray, God, even the more that you would equip him and strengthen him to be the worship pastor and the community pastor uh, that can uh, just be a, a guiding light and a protecting angel of what you plan and what you intend to do uh, in Crosswinds Church. And so, God, I pray even the more that you would continue to bless and strengthen him. Um, also, God bless uh, Pastor Ronnie. Thank you, God, for uh, her endeavors or her efforts, God. Um, all the many things she's done uh, to pastor, to shepherd, and to lead uh, in Crosswinds Church. God, I'm thankful for her. I'm thankful, God, for her efforts and her endeavors and for her commitment, God, and for her selflessness uh, and, her, and her commitment, God, just to seeing you uh, edified and glorified in everything that Crosswinds Church does. And so, God, I pray even the more that you will strengthen her, equip her, lead her. Uh, to continue to be the great pastor that she is, uh, whether it be in, a, in, a, in, a, in an executive role or in a discipleship role or uh, wherever you ask her to work or wherever you ask her to serve God, I pray God even the more that you would strengthen her and equip her to do uh, all the many great things uh, that you have in store. I also pray God for her family. I pray for her husband. I pray for her children. I pray for God for her household. And I pray even the more that you would equip her uh, to be the pastor that uh, you've already made her to be. Um, and I thank you for her as well. I thank you, God, uh, for our CW Kids Leader. I thank you, God, for Miss Amy 
and her and Cricket and her family, God. I pray even more that you would strengthen her. Uh, and, and thank you, God, for her efforts and her endeavors thus far. And I pray even more, God, that you will strengthen her uh, uh, for the future and also that you will bless her family. And I pray also for um, uh, our secretary. I pray for Miss Kim. I pray even more that you will strengthen her to be, uh, to continue to be the incredible secretary that she is, God. Um, not just in a sense of answering phones or taking notes or making copies, but allow her to continue to have that heart of gold that she has to put a smile uh, on, on people's faces whenever she encounters them and to just continue to fill in the gaps wherever it is needed throughout uh, the, the, the ministry endeavors of Crossman's Church. Uh, not, don't just bless her, God, bless her family, bless her husband, bless her children, um, and bless everything that she puts her hand to. Um, also, God, don't forget about little old me. Uh, strengthen me and equip me to be the best student ministry pastor that I can be. Um, and also, God, continue to bless my wife and uh, strengthen her uh, as she assists me and as she equips uh, and, and supports me um, in days that I, I need it the most. And bless my family, bless my incredible, uh, beautiful daughter and my incredible nephew as well. And um, allow us to continue to just seek you first. Because um, if we seek you first, God, then we'll never be last. Lastly, God, I pray for Crossman's Church as a whole, for the volunteers. I pray, God, for all those who fill in the gaps and for all those who show up early and stay late to see two of that ministry goes forward. And I pray even the more, God, that you would continue to have your way in Crossman's Church um, and allow us to continue to be that church that you're one day going to come back for without spot or wrinkle. I thank you. I praise you. And I glorify God for all these things. And it's all these things I ask in your son, Jesus the Christ, name I pray. And if you guys believe that, would you declare it by saying amen.